should be right. The Oakland Black Cowboy Association is celebrating its 50th annual Black Cowboy Parade and Festival. Here to tell us more about the history of this event is the president, Wilbert McAllister. Wilbert, thank you so much for being here at and Live in the morning, Bay. Good morning, Jessica, for sure. It's so we're so happy to have you here. I want to talk all about this parade and festival, but first I want to learn a little bit of the history um, of the Black Cowboy Association. Can you tell me a little bit about the history? I'd be delighted. Uh, it's going on our 50th year. Back in the beginning, before 1974, there were some black country boys, which is cowboys, come from the South, like Texas, Mississippi, Alabama. They came to California, they came to West Oakland. And they were just riding their horses. And they, uh, people in the neighborhood didn't know who they were, just called them black cowboys. Mm -hmm. And it was acceptable. And they were just riding after a while. They started meeting up every week in, and they formed a group called the Black Cowboys. And later on in life, we changed to the Oakland Black Cowboys Association mm -hmm. around about 2004. And how long have you been a part of the organization? I've been a part of the organization 20 plus years. I've been the current president for about 18 years. Yes, ma'am. That's amazing. And I feel positive about it. Good. What is the, your biggest aim? What do you guys hope that the community um, and people that are part of the association really get out of the association? That we're a peaceful organization and we're in a community environment where we touch all phases of life and all Americans are humans. We have little kids, mediocre kids, grown kids, young mothers, young fathers, and grandparents. And that's why we keep a clean environment. We have allowed no smoking, no drinking, no foul play in our event. And we keep it that way. And work within the community and our level. And the city of Oakland really help us out. Amazing. Um, you guys just want to be positive and uplifting for the community. Yes, ma'am. And you do that every year with a parade and festival. This is a big year because you're celebrating 50. 50th. Tell me what is going to be so special about this well, 50th celebration. And I'm going to make one thing clear. It's always the first Saturday in October. Whatever date that falls on, that's our date. And it's always the parade starts exactly at 10 o'clock. Mm -hmm. But what's special to me is I'm 83 years old now, and I feel my memory not sharp as it used to be, but I still feel positive when I see them little kids having clean fun. Don't worry about no, no hostility. It just but the atmosphere is there for clean fun, mm -hmm. and we do have vendors out there. And we have a lot of horsemen, uh, mixed horsemen. We have cowgirls as well now. A cowboy wouldn't be nothing without his cowgirl. I love that. And they, we'd be riding and unity, and we're, we're tipping our hats and waving our, waving, our, waving our hats and whatever. Just have clean fun in the community, yeah. yes, ma'am. So it's kicking off with the parade at 10 a.m.? That's correct, ma'am. And what But I'll see? be there at 6 o'clock in the morning. You have a lot to do as the president. <laughs> It'd be a busy day, but we look forward to it, yes, ma'am. And what are some of the highlights of the parade? What can people look forward to? I think they're seeing them uh, adults on the horses. Mm -hmm. And when they ride, there's a lot of people in the neighborhood that never been around a live animal, a big animal like a horse. Mm -hmm. And we have a pony too, but not so intimidating to the little kids. And they, we let teach them how to put their hands over the horse and smell them and receive them. And then we have pony rides and horse rides for the kids and young adults like yourself. They can ride. Control ride. We don't let nobody just ride off. <laughs> we walk them. Uh, another cowboy. Walk we can't them. have ponies and horses just going wild. In no, ma'am. Like, You're right, right about that. <laughs> but our, our animals are domesticated. They, we train them, and they've been trained since birth. Amazing. Yes, well, yeah, let's talk about some of the other things happening throughout the day because in addition to the parade, it's a festival, so of course there's music. Yes, uh, Tell me about all the other fun activities that families can enjoy. We do have a big old stage, four feet high, 20 feet long, 20 feet wide with a backdrop, and we host, have a live band, and we have like an open mic for that. If you think you can sing a little bit, you want to get up there with a professional band, please come, come. And I kind of sang a little bit. I, I'd be up there having fun with my band. We have a, a lead guitar, bass guitar, keyboard, drummer, and 
a horn player. Amazing. Wilbert, I have one question for you before I let you go. Please. What is, uh, what would you say is one of the biggest lessons that you've taken away from being a part of the Oakland Black Cowboy Association? Ah, uh, that's kind of hard, girlfriend, but <laughs> I think it just, Working within the community and seeing the smiles on them kids and seeing the, the young parents being happy that they kids in some good, safe environment. Mm -hmm. That means a lot to me. And there's no this, no bang, bang, none of that. We just, it's controlled atmosphere. And we set the tone. We set the tone for that. And we announce it quite a bit. Because we have an attitude problem. And the attitude problem we have is positive. We think positive. That they, and, but I do that in life myself now. But we have the, and we, brought, we talk about that attitude problem. Positive. Everybody come in and have clean, funny dress, the best they can to come in with the boots on. You got some boots on, girl? I did. I, I brought my boots, my boots, boots on. for you Look today. At that. Yes. So well, Wilbur, thank you so much for joining us. You have just been a delight. I know that the celebration is just going to be incredible and for the 50th for celebration. And I want to thank you for inviting us over here at Oakland Black Cowboy Association. This is a big, big deal for us. Of course. Thank you, Wilbur. Thank you, ma'am.